So for my show and tell, I just wanted to talk about contracts. And the one type of contract I wanted to focus on was implied contract. And what that is is an agreement created by actions of parties involved but not written or spoken. Um, this contract is usually assumed to be to have been drawn. And in some cases, there's no written record or any actual verbal agreement. So for my object, I wanted to use this picture um, of the Savior right here. So we know that the Savior was baptized and when he showed this action, he made an agreement with him and his father, a covenant, which is a promise um, that he entered into um, to keep the commandments that are created and basically to lead an example. So this promise that the Savior entered into, it's like an implied contract because he showed that he was willing to follow what God wanted him to do by his action, and that was baptism. And so us today, we make this same covenant or promise, and we imply it by taking ourselves the name of Jesus Christ and remembering him and keeping his commandments. And so when we think about implied contracts, we can remember it's just like the covenant that Jesus Christ made with God. And it's the same kind of contract or covenant that we make with God.